that God can do it. Like we read in the book last night, Henry Wright's book, sometimes you don't receive what you're believing for because you've only given mental assent. In order to put your trust in God for whatever it is you need, you have to take your trust out of you to do it. Take your trust out of your understanding. Because when we think we've got to understand more to receive from God, it is self-righteousness and unbelief. So right now we take our trust out of us and put our trust in you. And with that thought, with that belief from the heart, we say, God, you can and you will do what I cannot. trust out of yourself put your trust in Christ Yeah. 
an encounter with the Lord where he pointed his finger at me in the spirit and said, you don't trust me with a situation. And I said, oh Lord, show me. He said, well, your heart's not at rest. And anywhere your heart can't rest, you still don't trust. And so I went to the piano and I wrote that song as an act of faith. I will trust you, Lord. I will trust you. Then the thing he told me I didn't trust him about got worse. <laughs> a little while after that, and I was watching everything kind of trying to shake down around me. And the Lord reminded me, he said, you said you were gonna trust me, will you? And so in, I had some options. I can freak out and wonder what I'm going to do, what they're going to do, what he's going to do, what, what needs to happen, something needs to happen, or I can trust. So then I went to the piano and wrote, I will lift my eyes and tell my heart to magnify the Lord. When the enemy is closing in, your spirit is my sword and I'm protected by believing in the promises you give I am safe forever because you live I was saying that I was wanting to use fear anger rejection to protect myself but has that ever protected you not really. Rejection feels like a protective wall for a little bit, but it hides the enemy in our life. The Bible says in Psalm 91, your faithful promises are my armor and my shield. I'm safe forever because you live. I'm protected by believing. I'm protected by the promises and my link to the promise of protection is belief. You see, my link to complete protection, like say complete protection is here and the war is here. I can keep fighting, trying to win this battle with anger and rage and insecurity and guilt and worry. Or I can step into protection. The bridge is belief. Do you see what I'm saying? So here's the battle, there's protection. Here's the battle of rejection <laughs> or whatever, direction. I need direction and I feel rejection. Oh, what do I do? Uh, jump, here's belief. Oh, I'm safe. Who saves you? So I will lift my eyes and I'll tell my to magnify the Lord when the enemy is closing in your spirit is my soul and I'm protected by believing in the promises you give I am safe forever because you live one more time so I will
You 
tore the curtain and walked through for me And I can follow you into the open door of the heavenlies The struggle is real, but the veil is torn the struggle is real, but the veil is torn. The struggle is real, but don't let it take you out, because the veil is torn. Jesus Christ is born. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The struggle is real, but victory is certain. So don't stay in the struggle. Come on, I know life's a struggle. But victory is certain. And that struggle's producing perseverance and endurance. And it is showing that your faith is real. Showing that your faith is real. All oh, that struggle is producing perseverance and endurance and showing that your faith is real showing that your faith is real yeah the struggle is real but victory is certain the struggle is real real for real victory is certain the struggle's real the victory is certain I know your struggle's real It's not just in your head The victory is certain Cause he tore the curtain Cause he tore the curtain Jesus tore the curtain for dying for us thank you for shedding your blood because we could not save ourselves or anybody else you know as sure as you learn that you can't save yourself you're gonna need to learn you can't save anybody else either <laughs> it's trying to save yourself closely on the heels of trying to save yourself is trying to save somebody else yes or no who in the room has figured out, or is figuring out, you couldn't save yourself, but you're still trying to save somebody else? I don't know, you can't. Oh, we love you, Jesus. 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 Lord, thank you that you don't expect us to get it together and do it. <laughs> thank you, Lord, that you don't expect us to get it together and do it. Oh, thank you, Jesus, that you don't expect us to get it together and do it. But give it to you and trust in you, Lord.
What more does he have to do for us to trust him? Give us a chance. Oh, but he keeps working on us anyway.
Because of your love for us, we.